Hi, my name is Vincent and today I want to take a look at an SAT Venn Diagram question. So we have at Ulysses High School, 120 students are taking Earth Science and 90 students are taking Physics. If 30 students are taking both Earth Science and Physics, what is the ratio of the number of students taking only Earth Science to the number taking only Physics? So for this problem we want to make use of a Venn Diagram with counting problems. A Venn Diagram could be an excellent tool for finding the right answer. So we start off with two circles. We could label the first circle E for Earth Science, and we could label the second circle P for Physics. And now these three sets we could label X, Y, Z, where X represents the number of students taking only Earth Science, Y represents the number of students taking both Earth Science and Physics, and finally Z would represent the number of students taking only Physics. So now we go to the problem, and we're given that 30 students are taking both Earth Science and Physics. So this tells us that we could replace y with 30. So now we could use this information to find the number of students taking only earth science and the number of students taking only physics. So we're given that 120 students are taking earth science. So now we could set up the equation x plus 30 equals 120. And to reason why this is a valid equation we note that the number of students taking Earth Science is made up of the students taking only Earth Science and also the students taking both Earth Science and Physics. So that's why we're doing x plus 30 and we can set it equal to 120 because we're told that 120 students are taking Earth Science. So now to solve for x we just subtract 30 from both sides of this equation. And now 30 minus 30 will cancel and we have x is equal to 90. So now we can go to our Venn diagram and we can replace x with 90. So now to solve for z, we're going to do something very similar. We're told that 90 students are taking physics. So we could set up the equation z plus 30 equals 90. Because once again, remember, the number of students taking physics is made up of the students taking only physics and the students taking both physics and earth science. So this equation holds. So now to solve for z, we're going to subtract 30 from both sides. and we have z is equal to 60. So now we can replace this variable z with 60. So now we're almost done. We have to read the last part of this question. What is the ratio of the number of students taking only earth science to the number taking only physics? So we're comparing 90 to 60. And now we need to simplify this ratio we could cross off common zeros and now 9 and 6 both have a common factor of 3 9 divided by 3 is 3 6 divided by 3 is 2 so the ratio is 3 to 2 so we go to our answer key and we would select choice D okay well this is going to conclude this SAT Venn diagram question thank you all for watching and I hope that this video was helpful